It's a Monday afternoon and Afra is still stuck at work. She was supposed to be home and start making dinner for her friends. As she promised, she will be hosting tonight. She will not get enough time to go to the supermarket. What is she going to do? This is where our product, FastCart, comes to the rescue. FastCart is the first mobile grocery delivery app that is linked with the largest retail stores in Qatar, such as Almira, Lulu, Carrefour, Monopoly, just from the convenience of, of your mobile phone. This is how it would work. Once the order is placed, our delivery staff would go to the groceries from. There would be a freshness guarantee from all the retailer stores for all the products that are sold. This would ensure 100% customer satisfaction once the products are handed to our delivery staff. He would then deliver it to Afra. Afra can track the progress on the app as well. Now that we have a clear understanding on how the product works, let's dive into the business pattern that we have researched for FastCart. In a survey conducted in Qatar, we found that 81% of our survey respondents were between the ages of 18 to 35. We also found that 72% of our survey respondents were female. However, we have found that 88.9% of our survey respondents would love to use such an app. We have also conducted a survey with our participants about their shopping patterns for groceries. We have found that most of our customer shops from Almira, with Carrefour, Monoprix, Lulu and Family Food Center training behind. With the information gathered from the survey and the guidance of Professor Rattare, we were able to design the business model canvas for FastCart. The business model canvas has a lot of components, but we will talk about the cost structures and the revenue streams in detail. The initial costs for FastCart are mobile platform creation, the extensive marketing campaigns and leasing of vehicles, which would amount to 89,000 riyals. Based on the costs and revenue analysis done, we have calculated that we would break even an average. In our revenue streams, we will charge the customers a delivery fee with the additional charge if the customer wants to pay cash on delivery. We would uh, charge the retailers a merchandising fees. We have calculated the worst case scenario of our revenue streams and found that we would end the year with a net income of 500,000 riyals. Now let's talk about the key risks facing fast cart. The key risks are facing our business are failure to launch, retailer offering delivery options, and similar apps competing with us and the market. These key risks will be resolved by a heavy marketing and promotion campaign, having the advantage against retailers by offering multiple retailers selling on our app and the advantage of being the first app of its type in the market. With the key risk result, let's move on to the business growth plan for FastCard that we have analyzed for the next 3 to 5 years. Currently, FastCard is only operating in the capital city of Doha. Our growth plan includes expansion to serve all customers from al Wakra, al Khor, and al Rayyan. We also look into expanding to other countries in the Middle East. We thank you for your time and we hope that we have gained your interest in our business. We look forward to serving you in the near future.